Hello and welcome to Settlement Survival, where we're struggling, struggling, yeah, we're struggling to, <laughs> to speak, it looks like it, but we're struggling with food. And today the idea is that we see if our farms over here, if they're helping us with, with that, or if not at all, if we need to do uh, anything else. I do want to do more. I feel like we could be doing better. I feel like we need more animal pastures as well that will help us. And well, we have a full year until we have new immigrants, but I do believe we might need that. Before we do anything though, there are a few changes. So first thing is that the menus are now changed and they look quite good. They really, really look good. I don't know if there was any rebalancing of the game, but it seems like it had, so we might see some numbers going up or down in here, and that's something that we might need to keep an eye on. But yeah, that's for, for us to, to look after today. And that is also this new button in here, which is... Hold on, there is a traveling merchant in there, or we might have both already from in the last episode, I don't remember. But we have this other option, which is all about decoration. And there is quite a lot of things here that we can play around and make some interesting things. So we'll look into that in due time. But for now, I think the first thing that I want to do is probably start doing a new pasture because we just have this one if I'm not wrong. Yeah, that's the only one that we have. And I feel like we might need something else. Now, talk about space. We have forester huts in here and there. We have these gather huts around here. Nothing else that we would actually consume resources from this side of town. So I feel like we could build something around here, really. And if you go into the pasture, we can probably do... Oh, which size do I want to do this? We do have a road coming through there. So maybe if we do 13 by 13 and I can add another road in there. And that should be all right, I guess. In here, well, we probably just need a dirty road. Don't really need to do um, the rocks. Ah, I think the roads have been redesigned as well. And they look a little bit nicer now, which is quite good. So let's speed things up. Let's get this. What is that? This coin. <laughs> Make sure that we we have everything that we need. I mentioned before that we might need more storage, and we certainly need that. We do have the small warehouse and a normal warehouse. And I mentioned that I want to build something around here, hopefully. And that's where I'll do it. Have a lot of storage here, all full. Some in there, all full as well. I think this would be really beneficial. Now, things that we have to keep an eye on. Food is the first, obviously, it goes up and down quite fast. Water is another one that we might need to look into. We do have water in here. We have water over there. We have another one over here. And I feel like we should have something around this side. And I do have the fields over here. I might do another one in there. And that's a big well. And where I want to do this, I want to do it right here. And autumn just arrived. Cool. So this will probably will helpfully hopefully wow i'm mixing all the words today help people around this area with water and then we'll have one less issue to worry about seems like we are running out of food and we don't have any coal 
we don't well we have a little bit of fuel we don't have we have enough timber and some plank i might do even more timber that might be something that i do someone got injured we got a new tech point i don't want to do anything right now because we do need more immigrants otherwise we will be in trouble we just have two available labors and well that is a lot to do we have housing for them anyway like we have all those apartments this one has eight capacity this one 24 so we'll be all good now food we have this fishing going that we put down last time this one as well so we're getting some fish we are finally getting some food actually it's improving what i feel like we need here is some sort of mining because we are running out of stone very soon we still have a lot of iron ore so that's not really needed i think fuel if we can make coal then that'll be something that we can do now is that something that we have unlocked or do we need to unlock that there we go i'm, I'm just blind it was <laughs> here and the resource the last item all the time so let's see what happens oh we got one more labor now now i meant to say nice anyway we are building this around here hopefully which is lovely that we have this storage now which is getting up to capacity already so what i want to do here i definitely want to do a stone road going through there it's great to see that it goes right where we wanted um so this will produce coal and that hopefully will help with domestic fuel now if we do have enough timber should we build another chopping house or what is our other one if i look at processing and chopping house we have one over here we have a limit of 700 which is nowhere near that interesting yeah we made 500 might not be enough anymore with coal that will help us quite a lot maybe we just wait and start doing coal and see what happens there we well we have a lot to do here have we done the soap workshop there we go we do have it we are using fat to make soap which is pretty good uh, we do have enough we need more herbs actually can we do i think i saw something the other time in here um we'll grow herbs there we go for that we need apiary which we don't have yet so let's let's go towards that then let's work on an apiary or apiary i don't know exactly how to say that and let me pause this a little bit because there are some things that i want you to do so can we fit oh we can fit in here perfect for this one we definitely need some animals we do have sheep in here i will do alpaca so we can have alpaca meat as well 15 sounds good enough and i want to sneeze give me a second again oh that was bad timing but his needs is done <laughs> let's get some coal in there so we can get more fill and well hopefully this is all going to work out so we are building the apiary in here which is quite good we need clay though hmm. we need a sand pit now do we have a sand pit i would say mining sand pit good 
So these harvest sand or clay. I feel like we might need two of those because we need both sand and clay very, very soon. And where I'm thinking to have this? Well, we could... Oh, can't fit in there. All right. Might do this other one around here. And then we can just bring that road down and we should be okay. So I'll keep a stone road from there. Hopefully this is all this waiting for the, the clay. I'll leave them do it. We shouldn't take long to get those two also done. We have reached the limit for water. All right, so it seems that we might need to increase the production limit in here just to be on the safe side. Food is still uh, so, so close to fail. We have seven members now. Like a lot of people have been graduated from school. We need a few in here. So I might wait for us to do that first and then we work on food or should we work on food first? We have work cards, we have lettuce. Mm, well, might get more people working on those I thought this is flex well we need flex anyway so let's have at least two people working there and then we still have three available this is iron ore that we need so that's good and feels like we might need let me just double check this yeah we might need another storage around here and how to get a small one so we don't get into the area of this forester hut which we don't want to do now oh this is oh we need to build this one all right let's prioritize this this is almost done hopefully they'll do it rather quick because we definitely need this apiary should be done for well actually we don't need that but i would like that that's a completely different story there <laughs> so bear with me now what is agriculture all right groves so same function as orca and can use fertilizer to boost yield um all right let's get that one done and then we have the nursery available which then we also need clay and that's fine we can build that we definitely need something like that because we well let me just choose this good to go and we need herbs as you can see we are kind of running low and nursery and groves so for nurseries unfortunately this is a little bit bigger than i thought so maybe I'll get two of those going in here and we'll see how that works. For this one, we will get sand from that and we don't have any more available laborers. Now, one thing that I would like to do is to, for places where we have like available job positions, that they would fill those positions automatically like that we had a way to do that but unfortunately we can't do that yet but hopefully we will do it oh our harvest brought thousand food finally <laughs> we're doing it we are doing it let's see our little alpacas in here they look so cute we have a baby alpaca we have a bigger alpaca oh look at that sheep <laughs> we definitely can get some wool from there <laughs> Pretty cool. I love it. Now, it seems like we do have a lot of um, plants in here. And I want to gather it all. We don't use gather anything. We don't usually gather anything in this area because of the forest hut. But we can get that. That's not a problem at all. So, we're surviving. We have food. We... What is this? 19 citizens, one new house. Yeah, 
you do have plenty of space in here, so go for it. Hold on, they still wanting home, house. Yeah, just move over there. Unless you want like individual house, then that's something entirely different, which we are not doing right now. But this, well, with clay there, but why are we building that first? Please prioritize this one. We can get the apiary going and then we go for the nurseries and then we will be good. Look at that. We survived the food shortage and <laughs> we are now thriving on food, actually. We have especially peas. We have a lot of peas. Have some lettuce, some wild vegetables, some mushrooms, cabbage. Cool. That's good to see. We're getting better now. It seems like we need more clothing though. Uh, well, now to remember where we have a tailor in here. So we do have enough wool. We might need a new labor in there to see if that helps. And then I'll probably increase the limit for 500, especially if we get those new um, immigrants. We will definitely need more and more. So, like this is an, the oh, what the word I'm looking for the never-ending cycle. That's several words I was looking for. <laughs> but we we have all this, and we need more, and we need more, and we need more people, and then we need more research and more people and more research and so on and so on. So yeah, that that helps. But good, this is being built now. Our API will be up and running quite soon and we are building our nursery as well we need quite a lot of points in, points in there but this will balance things out hopefully let's take a look at types of produce that we have we have vegetables we have beans we have the raw materials and we have staple foods which can be used for brewery which we might need oh we have we have the highest city health that's good so less consuming stamina 10 percent slower and yeah i think in highest consumes what stamina 10 percent per 25 percent health what stamina minus 10 percent per 25 percent health after 100 percent all right I, let's let's say that I understand that <laughs> we are good in this um, population and happiness is what we need to help people with to help people with happiness church theater alcohol candy and fancy food so honey and beeswax I don't know what Edible but harmful to health. What? Honey. Interesting. Can be used for soap or lightning. Well, we have... I think we can produce... Or maybe we don't produce anything at the moment. And let's close this. We, we don't need that yet. We'll need very, very soon. And then we get someone working oh we don't have seeds available for that well how do we get seeds for herbs all right we do have immigrants arriving we have 13 let's get them joining us someone has the plague i believe yeah and but then we have a lot of people that we can use in here we need more tools by the looks of it do we and where is the smith there we go this one so tools we use iron ore we use that we have two people working that i just had the limit i'll just increase that to a thousand and we should be able to work on that without any problem for alcohol, do we have a 
brewery. Um, distillery. There we go. What are we producing? We are producing spirits. And we might need... Well, I'll increase this. Actually, let's do 750 and see what we can get there. Clothes, we might need more, but with a lot of new people, this went down, that's fine. We still need... Well, we can work on construction material if that's the case. We need more herbs. I wonder if we can try to find some seeds around this place. Seems like something good to do. Let's gather all that we can that's around us and see if we get those seeds. But I think for today we had some pretty good progress and I'm quite happy with that. I will be back next time and we'll probably take a look at more food, maybe more pasture and things like might be a good way to go. So we get like more wool and things like that and we can get more clothes, for example. That might be the way to go. And But yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about all of this and what should be our next step. Leave a like as well and consider watching the video on your screen because you might enjoy that. Thank you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.